Hey, what's going on guys? So it's been a while since I made a video. It's been about two months or, sh or so, which is way longer than I've gone in the past five, six years. And a lot of people have been asking me if everything's all right. And the answer is yes. I've just been really busy working on my uh, modern JavaScript 2.0 course, which is finally done. And it's a 37 hour course, which is almost double the older course and double any, any course that I've ever created. Now, another reason that I've been really busy is because I've, I've finally created my own website, my own platform where I can sell and host my courses. So this course, as well as about 10 others, which comes out to about 250 hours of content are now available at traversymedia.com. And I'm putting a, a promo link in the description to get this course and any course for just $15. So I've been working on this particular course for the past five or six months. And I, I wanted to essentially create a JavaScript bootcamp that includes everything from learning, you know, data types, manipulating the DOM, um, animations, web APIs, object oriented programming, and then getting into tooling with Webpack and front end workflows, we even get into unit testing, data structures and algorithms, and then there's uh, a couple bonus sections where we actually create a full stack uh, web application using Express MongoDB on the back end. And we create a completely custom front end using Webpack, creating um, you know, UI based components, just like you would with a framework, except it's vanilla JavaScript. So really, really cool. And I wanted to, I wanted this to basically take you from absolute beginner to slightly advanced in terms of concepts. So there's all types of projects from a CRUD shopping list to an object oriented calorie tracker uh, with classes and local storage and bootstrap five components. There's also a, a, a movie app called Flix that uses the movie database API. So it's kind of like a Netflix layout and we have search and pagination and it's all vanilla JavaScript. There's no um, there's no frameworks. I shouldn't say it's all vanilla because we do use a couple small libraries. Like there's a library called Swiper that we use for the um, for the the slide slider component, but it's mostly just pure vanilla JavaScript. Um, there's a bunch of mini projects as well. But what I really wanted to do is not just do a project course. I have a bunch of those. I have a 50 projects course, a 20 projects course. This one, I wanted to obviously have projects, but I also wanted to do a lot of learning modules where we focus on certain concepts, whether it's promises or error handling. I also wanted to really look under the hood at things like execution context and the call stack and uh, the event loop, things that a lot of courses kind of leave out. So teaching you how JavaScript works, not just the syntax. You know, when we, when we code and we watch tutorials, Sometimes you get that aha moment where something that you've try, been trying to learn for months just finally clicks. And I want this course to, to be just constant clicks where, you know, things that, that you don't really, you know a little bit about, but you don't, don't fully understand. Um, my goal is for this course to make that those things finally click and, and help you uh, learn the things that you've been trying to learn. So like I said, there's a promo code for just $15. Yeah, you can also get all of my courses for 25 bucks a month and cancel at any time. I added it all together. It's about 250 hours of content. Uh, I just want to say that Udemy is, I have nothing against Udemy. They've obviously helped me boost my career as a, a course creator and, and a content creator. But I think it's time that I just focus more on my own website and kind of cut out the middleman. There's been a lot of changes in terms of pricing and stuff like that. And at the end of the day, I'm averaging about three or $4 per course sale, sometimes less than that, sometimes one or $2, which, you know, I, I'm not someone where it's all about money for me, obviously, I, I, I taught for free for years and years, but it starts to feel a little degrading when you're getting, you know, a dollar 20 for a course sale, when you put your heart and soul into that course, and you spend months making it. So I just want to kind of move on and, and try to do my own thing, you know, and I'll be constantly updating courses. Now I'm actually in the process of updating my Mern e-commerce course. That's why you don't see it on the website because I'm in the process of updating it now. 
I'm creating a Bootstrap 5 course. I'm also going to get into other languages like Python and Golang. So if you do go the membership route, you have full access to all courses, cancel at any time, um, and you can do monthly or yearly. And I'd appreciate it if you guys just check it out, you know, even if you don't have money to, to pay for courses or anything, if you want to just check out the website, I'd appreciate it. Uh, I've really just kind of worked my ass off over the last few months with, um, with this, this JavaScript course and getting this all together. Now, as far as YouTube goes, I'm not disappearing. I just, I kind of needed a break from the constant uploading and needing to, to think of new ideas. Believe it or not, it's very, it's very stressful to try and get a video out every week. It really wears on you and it stops you from doing other things that you want to do. Um, so after like nine or 10 years of this, it, it, I needed a, a good long break. You know, I've taken a week or two off before, but um, this was, was really refreshing to be able to do this. But now I'm ready to get back at it. I'm going to be doing my annual uh, roadmap video that I do every year that everybody is asking for. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on in AI, chat GPT. I know everybody's making a video on it. Um, but Regardless, I've been using it quite a bit and really want to talk more about AI and, and, and what it means for the future of, of web developers. But that's pretty much it, guys. I just wanted to let you know where I'm at. Um, I will be back to making videos soon. Uh, again, I'll have the link in the description to the course and the platforms if you want to check that out. And I just want to thank all you guys for you know sticking around, subscribing, watching, and all that. And I will see you soon.